And today, I'm going to be talking about my top must-haves for cooking in the RV. I know I have been missing. I've been gone for probably almost a month. It's so hard to get videos done. We've been redoing the bathroom, we've been doing the hall, and then you have Christmas all in there. Now I have my veil shirt on. That's because at the first of next month, we are headed to Steamboat Springs and I may or may not have any videos while we're there. But we have such an action-packed two weeks that we will be there. I don't want to spend time editing videos while we're on the trip, but I will be getting some great content and we'll be going back to what this originally this channel was founded on was travel. And if you notice the intro, I changed it up. I just wanted to do a generic intro that kind of just shows you what all our channel is about. Because if you're new to the channel, welcome and I hope you'll subscribe. And if you've come back, welcome back. My two must-haves cooking in the RV. And yes, I know there's a lot of people, they do not cook in their RV. They never cook on their stovetop. They never use their oven. I use them all the time. We cook in our camper a lot, especially during hunting season. Now, when we travel, I probably don't cook in it as much, but when we are at the hunting club, I use the kitchen a lot. If you're somewhere where it's warm outside, using the kitchen can heat up your camper so quick. So my, one of my favorite things that I like to have is an air fryer. This is my very first air fryer and I have new ones that I like better and I'll link the video up here to let you know which one that is. But the, this Ninja, this one has worked great. It's a good size for the RV. They even make some that are smaller than this. But I wouldn't go any smaller than this just because I can cook what I want. We heat up stuff in here. We cook things in here. It does it faster and it doesn't heat the whole camper up. And it saves on gas. So if you're hooked to power, why use your gas when you can use electric? Why not just use the campsite's electric instead of your gas? So I would say if you don't have one, get you a small air fryer. This thing cooks hot dogs in it really good. It cooks, it cooks hot dogs, it heats up pizza. If you need pizza reheated, it only does a few slices though. So though that if you're gonna do a big batch, it's not gonna work. I love cooking chicken in mine. That is like a great thing to do. Next week, I'm going to do a video that's going to give you tips and tricks for cooking in your kitchen. So my second item is a crock pot. I love a crock pot just because it is super easy. You can just put whatever you want in here in the morning when you get up and it's ready by that afternoon. It's usually no fuss cooking to cook in a crock pot. Also, I think it's great to keep things warm like chili or stuff like that because if you put it on your stove, you're gonna have to keep the gas running, where with this, you're using, again, you're using the electricity of the campsite that you're at. So I really would say that a crock pot is something great. Now, my third thing, and you really could make this only two, so it's, it's totally your call if you just have two items, because this here is a pressure cooker and it is a crock pot. Now, to me, I like it, but I just like having my crock pot and this. I keep both of them, but to save on space, you could just totally have one. This one is really old. I don't know if you're like me, but I buy new for the house and bring the old to the camper, so the camper gets our old stuff. And the Instapot, I cook rice in here. It takes 20 minutes on the stove to cook, and in, in, in the Instapot, it only takes about eight or 10 minutes. It just seems like it takes so long for the water to boil on the stove. Now, some of the items, and this is kind of like a bonus tip, a lot of people love to cook outside their RV and they don't use their inside at all and they'll cook outside and you can get like a grill, you can get the flat stone, what is that? That grill? The grill, the big nice grill. I'll, I'll, I'll put a picture up here. 
you can get one of those so that if you like cooking outside, you could definitely do that. I just wanted to tell you what my favorites were, which is gonna be my air fryer. That's gonna be my number one. My number two is gonna be a crock pot. And my number three is gonna be a pressure cooker. Till next time, like and subscribe.